Actually, it's kind of too bad we're not coming into work tomorrow. Why? I bet Michael had some elaborate theme party planned, like scrambled eggs Saturday. I'm like, hey everyone, let's get your boss laid Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> I have an announcement uh, to make. I am moving to Costa Rica. Thought about it for a long time now, and I'm finally gonna do it. So, I'm just gonna hop the fence and jog home now. Music? Should uh, we turn some music? Yeah. That okay. sounds good. Yeah. Do you guys remember my old assistant Hunter? He is an excellent songwriter. We didn't hear this. Okay, here we go. You took me by There she is. I swear, Phyllis, you are as beautiful as the first day you started work at Dunder Mifflin. Thanks, Michael, that's sweet. Same as when you said it outside. Mm. How you doing? You excited? Yes, very. Me too. If, um, if you need to vomit, that is okay. I did. Do you want to talk about tonight? Uh, no. Because I know you're probably worried about pleasing Bob, a lot of pressure. Did you break wind? It's okay. If you did, it's a very natural reaction. It's your wedding, and you're nervous. That wasn't me. Okay. Um, I'm sure that Bob... Wow, that is... That is pungent. Um, I lost my train of thought. Ah. Uh, are you set on that hairstyle? I thought it was. Yeah, let me. Michael, no. Just cover I don't up need that bald patch. Thank you. No, Michael, please. I just need some time alone. Okay. Okay. Are you okay? I'm gonna be. Hi. I'm just gonna just for a sec, just a sec. Um, everyone, I'm sorry. Should I have your attention, please? Thank you. Ah, hi, sorry, I just have an announcement to make. Um, okay, I have learned a lot about Indian culture tonight, but I have learned even more about love. And I know you're all thinking, who is this crazy gringo and what is he talking about? Well, I'm not crazy. Maybe I'm crazy in love. So, without further ado, Carol, Carol Stills, I would like you to do me the honor of making me your husband. Oh, Michael. What do you say? Can we talk about this in private? I didn't hear you. Can we talk about this in private? Jada, no, 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 Jada, what are you doing? Oh, so sorry, guys. I hope my family didn't disrupt your meeting. Daddy, are these the people who are making you manager? <sighs> Maybe, sweetheart. <sighs> Single dad challenges. I don't know if he'd be a good manager, but he's a really great dad. Okay, shush it. This was a mistake. Let's go. And do you, Phyllis, take Bob Vance, Vance Refrigeration, to be your lawfully wedded husband? 
I do. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you, for the first time as a couple, Mr. and Mrs. Bob Vance! And do you, Bob, take Phyllis to be your lawfully wedded wife? Tony, please join your cohorts on the table, if you would. Uh, this is difficult for me. Hey, I understand. We're all friends. No, I mean, I can't physically. I can't get on the table. Oh, well, just use the momentum of your lower half to hoist yourself up. You know what? I'll help. I will no, help. No, please don't. Don't be shy. Dwight, let's do this. Do come this. on. Come We're on. doing this thing. Ready? Let's get up. On three. One, two. Bend the knees. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm under this. I'm under this hock here. I don't know what I'm grabbing here. All right. All right. But stop. It feels good. Put me down. Push it. Down. Push it. Down. Push it. Down. I'm right in your crack. No, no, put me down. Open the Open the door. You got it. You got it. You got it. Put me down right now. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Okay. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm rejecting I, I, your what? kiss. What? I didn't. <sighs> Can I have a ride home? If you sit in the back. This is guy, he's at a nymphomaniac convention. And he is psyched, because all these women are smoking hot, perfect tens, except for this one chick who looks a lot like, uh... Phyllis? Yeah. No, 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 that crosses the line. Excuse me? Not you. Kevin, just unwarranted. Hostile work environment, Kevin. Well, Packer said it. No, you said it. He pointed. A point is not a say. Look, Kevin... We are a family here. And Phyllis is a valued member of that family, like a grandmother. I'm the same age as you, Michael. Well, I don't know about that. We're the same but, high school class. Well, I have a late birthday, and usually September is a cutoff point. <laughs> you know what? You just crossed the line, OK? There's a line, and you went over it. And you must be punished. So go to your corner. You mean where my desk is? Yes, your corner, go. OK. I have a lot of work to do anyway. Mm -hmm. Oh, my. They really got to you, didn't they? They didn't get to me. I got to them. I am still the same old Michael Scott. New and improved. You know what? I love Phyllis. You know what else? I think she is gorgeous. I think she is an incredibly, incredibly attractive person. Come here. Come here, Chris. <laughs> Come on. Michael, come on. Come on. Oh. You don't have to worry. I'm not there. I'm not. To report I'm not worried. To HR you know what? The only thing I am worried about is getting a boner. Good work today, everybody.